Well, ABC 4's Curtis Booker spoke with a Logan man infected twice with COVID and the issue he's still facing. Travis Smith of Logan says he still suffers with a heightened condition of what's called tachycardia, where he experiences an elevated heart rate and it happens at least once a day. The condition is basically just like a rapid heartbeat, uh, not not all the time, but or an out of sync heartbeat. Most recently diagnosed with COVID back in January of this year, he says it was after his original infection back in July of 2020 when he realized the severity of this issue. Travis Smith says the condition he's dealt with sparingly since the age of eight. He says after his initial diagnosis of COVID, it just got worse. What I noticed after that initial episode is just several episodes of tachycardia started happening. It was, uh, it started to become consistently throughout the day. The cardiologist acknowledged that uh, COVID is known to do damage to the cardiovascular system. And this is uh, uh, something that she, she was seeing an uprise in. As the state says they're ready to move on to a more stable phase of the pandemic, Smith says he hopes long haulers aren't forgotten. And a little frustrating, uh, to, to, to put it bluntly, because we, uh, we know what we're struggling with. We know what we're dealing with. Many of us were totally healthy prior to uh, being infected with COVID. Smith says he also still deals with fatigue and a slight cough. He says he's grateful for the community group like the Utah Long Haulers. Just having individuals there that you can vent to uh, that that have that direct relation and uh, know what you're going through. It's it's a total game changer. It OK, that was Curtis Booker reporting. A recent study shows that people who suffered a severe infection of COVID were 40 percent more likely to experience ongoing problems related to their COVID infection, regardless of diagnosis.